Hi, good morning. We're learning so much today. It's Wednesday and the sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. And this is our math and number skills class. You guys are growing and growing, growing, growing every day. If you like to grow fast, this is the way. Growing bigger than before. Every hour that you sleep, you grow a little more. You guys remember that song? Okay, so we're growing and growing, and we're learning and learning new things. Okay, so let's start with our poem about growing that's on page 148. Do you see it right there? Yeah, you do? Great. Okay, here we go. One. Two, three, when I started kindergarten, I couldn't have felt smaller, but I've been growing, growing, and not just growing taller. I've learned to read, I've learned to write, I've learned my numbers too. And there are many other things that I have learned to do. Kindergarten's over now, but I am not afraid because I know I'm ready to enter first grade. Yay! And you're ready too. Yay! So happy for you. Okay, let's start with a little game. Do you remember our before and after game? Do you remember it? The sun's kind of shiny here. Can you see it? Okay, here we go. Round and round my finger goes where it stops. No one knows. What number comes before 34? Do you know? <gasps> yes, 33. What number comes after 34? <gasps> That's right, 35. Ready for another one? Here we go. Round and round my finger goes where it stops. No one knows. <gasps> 16. What number comes before 16? 15. That's right. What number comes after 16? 17. That's right. Okay. Here we go. Want another one? Here we go. Round and round my finger goes where it stops. No one knows. 67. What number comes before 67? 66, that's right. What number comes after 67? 68, that's right. Another one, round and round my finger goes where it stops, no one knows. 59, what number comes before 59? That's right, 58. What number comes after 59? 60, that's right. Last one. Round and round my finger goes where it stops. No one knows. 14. What number comes before 14? 13. What number comes after 14? 15. Super duper. Okay, and I want us to review our coins. I have some money here. Okay. You hear it? Jingle, jingle, jingle. Okay. This is a, can you see it? Penny. Yeah, it's a penny. Let me turn it this way. Money, money, money in my pocket. A penny is worth one cent. That's right. It's made out of copper. Okay, now we have the next one. Are you ready? Oh, here it is. Whoops, it fell. Here it is. This is a nickel. Money, money, money in my pocket. A nickel is worth five cents. This many. Yeah, there's a nickel. Do you see it? There you go. All right, the next one. Here's, do you see it? called a dime. A dime is worth, do you know how much a dime is worth? 
10 cents. That's right. Time is worth 10 cents. Okay. And this one is bigger than a dime or a nickel or a penny. And it's called a quarter. It starts with the letter Q. Qua, qua, quarter. And a quarter is worth 25 cents. Let me show you what 25 is on our, right here. 25 cents. So it's 10, 20, five. 25 cents. So you need four of these to make 100. Okay, you got it. Awesome. Okay, now let's turn our number skills book to page. 140. You guys are almost done. Okay, so we're going to start here on page 140. And it, up here at the top says, circle the flower that has a B to the right. Do you remember? <gasps> we could do our poem. <gasps> yes, I like our poem. Our right hand and left hand poem. Okay, you can turn around so you can do it with me with the, if you turn and look to the wall and don't look at me, look over there, then you can have the same hands as me, okay? This is my right hand. I'll raise it up high. This is my left hand. I'll touch the sky. Right hand, left hand, roll them around. Left hand, right hand, Pound, pound, pound. Okay, so you have to circle the flower that has the B to the right. Okay, which one? You know, you've got this. Okay, number two. Match the coins with what they will buy. So here, five, 10, 15. What could I buy if I had 15 cents? Mm, an apple? Nope, that's 20 cents. A pear? No, that's 35 cents. Some strawberries? Yes! So I'll match. I can buy, with 15 cents, I can buy some strawberries. Good. Number three, add. You know how to do that. Circle the number that is the most, okay? You know, most, okay, most, got it. Now, we have an evaluation this morning too. Here we go, write our names at the top, nice and neat, and it says, listen as your teacher reads the story problem. Are you listening? Stop, look, listen. Megan saw two bunnies. We're gonna read about a stories about bunnies in our closing. And two squirrels in the meadow. The meadow's like the grass. So two bunnies and two squirrels. How many bunnies and squirrels did she see all together? So if she saw two bunnies and two, two bunnies and two squirrels, how many did she see together? You got it. Write the combination. You know how to do it. Good. Write number here, number two. Write the before and after numbers. That's what we were doing in our game. Before and after. What number comes before 51? What number comes after 51? You got it. <gasps> number three. Add. You got this. Super good. Number four. Write how many cents. Remember, we just saw a quarter is worth. <gasps> you know it. Okay. And number five says, write. What time is it? What time is it? We need to write it right there. You know how to do that. Okay. Super good. And our last page for today is <gasps> fun with Numbers, page 142. Circle the one that comes next. So we'll just do this one. Butterfly, butterfly, B. Butterfly, butterfly, what comes next? B, that's right.
And there's some skunks. And there's some a basket and some ants. And there's a red bird and there's some bunnies. Tuck your little hands in, get ready to pop down and up and hop, hop, hop. Okay, and that is our class for today. Keep up the good work and I will see you tomorrow.